my name is Troy Van Leeuwen, and I play in Queens of the Stone Age. Well, I got a lot of stuff, because why not? Um, I have a tentacle, which is, for me, one of the best pe pedals, you know, because there's no knobs at all. There's one setting, and you just on or off. Um, so I use that quite a bit um, for the upper octave. And the Rainbow Machine is set up like a, it's only going to one amp, so it's set up like a tight room. Um, with no modulation at all, so it's just really crisp and tight. So that goes through through, these, through this cabinet here. So I have a, a dry and a wet situation for both lap steel and guitar. I'm not like a great lap steel player, but I can make a lot of noise, so that's why this is always getting bigger and bigger, this pedal board. And over here, there are not really, really many pedals except for one boost and the super ego. But everything else is set up through this, through this mastermind kind of looping system. Um, so all the pedals are in a rack. Because um, there's so many like changes between each section of each song. I can't, I, I just don't want to step on three pedals at one time. So this does it all for me. That way I can just focus on playing my rock and roll guitar. I've got my signature Jazz Master out there, uh, and this is kind of how the, the signature uh, started. It's basically, it's a new American uh, vintage, I guess they call it. Um, I basically took this guitar, put my color on it, and put the switch on it, so it's pretty much the same signature model. My Echo Park de Leon, um, it's like a kind of a signature model with him. He's only like 13 made though. And this is another custom shop piece. It's a copper relic 12 string, Telly. Not many of these. Another spoiling custom shop guitar that no one else has. <laughs> Basically, it's my, my signature model on the bottom and and like a hybrid of that guitar and, a, and an electric 12 uh, on top. So this thing breaks my shoulder every night. So we got enough 12 strings for, to drive Wayne nuts. <laughs> yeah, oh yeah. See, those are, those, are, those are backups. This is a pedal that I used um, on the Gone Is Gone record, like, like almost, like half the record has this pedal on it. And over here is kind of where all the your, uh, I've got all the, the shelves of all the stuff. Yeah. This yeah. is all the gain stage, some compression, uh, and uh, and uh, again, this is like going through one side of my my chain. So this is the wet side. That's the setting I usually use. I'm just plug in whatever's there. I mean, uh, if if like if it's there, I just kind of turn it on and check it out. And if it works, it works. But it's per song usually. It's per sound. I mean, that's why we've got so many different companies, different pedals, um, because you know they they just all have different signatures. So yeah, I mean, I'm I'm just uh, I'm really easy about it. I just plug it in, turn some knobs, and, and go. And these usually pretty quickly, I can tell whether I like it or not.